Good evening, everyone. So before I begin, uh, I just want to say that I've been planning to do this video for months, ever since I started contemplating the idea of walking across Louisiana. Uh, but something very interesting happened within the last uh, 24 hours. Um, so I was looking at the rising Ask Reddit threads, and it was just called, uh, What Are You Good At? So I'm good at walking, <laughs> specifically walking, knowing how to walk long distances. So I put walking. Uh, I've, I've walked across five of the 50 states and Louisiana's next. And that comment blew up <laughs> more than I would have ever expected it to. And so much so that someone asked if I was documenting the trip um, I put links to the YouTube videos of the five states that I've walked across, and that gave me about 100 new subscribers in the last 24 hours. So if that's one of you, hi and welcome! Welcome from Reddit. <laughs> the $64,000 question, which you're probably wondering, and it's been asked on the thread. If you started with a whole bunch of uh, New England states and Delaware... <laughs> Um, why the hell did you choose Louisiana, is the question. And the, the thing is, I, if uh, you're not aware, um, I'm originally from uh, South Texas. I went to school in w Worcester, Massachusetts, and my school went by quarters instead of uh, semesters with about a week or so of breaks in between the quarters. And that allowed me to walk across a small state. So, I didn't necessarily walk across the, the smallest states because uh, th that's all I could do, but simply because that's all I had the time for. And that's the same reason why I'm doing Louisiana right now. I have the time for it. I have the privilege of having the time for it. I am between jobs at the moment. I have something lined up for me in January if all goes well. And I decided Louisiana because I wanted to make it an experimental state uh, for a couple reasons. Um, before now, the longest that I've ever been on the road is 11 days. 11 days of just pure walking, and that was Vermont. 10 days to get to the Canadian border from Brattleboro at the south end of the state, and then one more day to get to St. Albans, where the train was that would take me back to Massachusetts. Uh, 11 days. So I wanted a state that was not too small, but not particularly large. Um, something that would allow me to walk nearly double the amount that I did in Vermont to see how well I would do on the road. So, Louisiana. Uh, apart from being experimental in terms of uh, distance and mileage, it's, it'll also be experimental in terms of, say, uh, culture and people. So uh, being from uh, the, the Rio Grande Valley, that's as far south in Texas as you can go, um, but it's not the deep south. It, it, it's the, the geographical deep south, but it's not, say, the, the cultural deep south. Um, right here, um, you don't really um, find you know, the stereotypical southerners or people don't really talk in southern accents. So this trip will be my first time uh, interacting and socializing and mingling with uh, these types of people. And Louisiana especially um, is very unique because they, there's uh, plenty of southerners there who are of French descent, uh, Cajuns. Which leads me to the third reason as to why this trip will be experimental. Because I really, really want to emphasize on the aspect of the conversation and why I think that's the most important part of all the state walks. Uh, because it has to do with making friends, having conversations that literally don't occur anywhere and any when else, learning from new perspectives, so on, so on. I I'm going to take this trip as an opportunity to experiment with how the videos will be uploaded on YouTube. Uh, because before uh, before now, all the state walks were one, four, five, six minute summary video and daily vlogs. But the thing is, with these medium to large sized states, um, the daily vlogs will 
it'll just add up and add up and add up. So how about instead of the the five minute summary video, I'm thinking of doing like a 45 to one hour long mini movie, mini documentary, however you want to call it, with narration, some background music, stuff like that. And because I really want to get the, the conversations in, because in, in the daily vlogs, especially those in Delaware and New not New Hampshire, Vermont, I did put some of the conversations that I had with the locals within the daily vlogs, but I had to cut them short. And if you ha if you cut them short, then sometimes you lose context. Sometimes you lose you lose a little bit of the conversation, you know. <sighs> And it, it's just not the same. It's just not the same. So apart from the 45 one hour uh, long video of the whole experience, I also want to upload uh, separate videos about conversations. Uh, you know, the, the raw, the unedited <laughs> conversations that uh, I've had with the locals. That I will have with the locals in Louisiana. But before I even upload anything, I'm just going to concentrate on the trip itself. I still have one more day to gather as much research and information and to do some, some warm-up walking around Brownsville before um, I fly to Shreveport. I'll be flying to Shreveport on Wednesday and it should take roughly 19 to 21 days to get to New Orleans. Ideally 19, but I, I gave myself two and a half day leeway for the, the return trip back home. Uh, people have been telling me to look out for mosquitoes, so I'll buy plenty of bug spray over there. Uh, they've also been telling me to beware the heat, um, but I'm from South Texas. I was born into the heat, molded by it. <laughs> so it's not a... Uh, that big of a concern. Uh, I'll just make sure to stay hydrated. Uh, also, uh, a, a quick shout out to our Louisiana, whom they, they've they graciously provided me with great, great suggestions after I showed them uh, a, um, a map of uh, my expected trip. They said, go here, do this, eat this, eat that. Guys, I'm gonna get so fat. I'm gonna get so fat on Cajun cuisine. Oh, my God, yes. Wow. Now, yeah, I'm, I'm actually really excited. I really want this to go great. And, you know, let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. I am happy to, to walk into Louisiana for the first time and walk 19 to 21 days from Shreveport to New Orleans. Let's see what happens. Have a good one, take care, happy adventuring, and kick ass.